If you're from Norway or Minnesota, chances are you know what lefse is. The thin potato bread is a Norwegian Christmas tradition. So, just in time for the holiday, we sent Susan Elizabeth Littlefield to find the very best, and your vote sent her two hours northwest of the cities to Osakis, where she met some very spirited bakers. Door. Trying to get this crew to pose for the camera Cut. <laughs> can be a bit tricky. But don't be fooled. They are anything but a group of goof offs. So we do probably around 800 a day. Well, right now we're probably doing around 1,200. It's the busiest time of the year at Jacob's Lefsa. It's getting slim. The demand is so high. The limit is low. If I come back with a mustache and a beard, then I can buy another one. No, you won't be able to. I'll know. They run a tight ship. Bonnie Jacobs is captain. It takes practice. A lot of people just do it once a year, and, and they're never going to get good at it. They've had a lot of practice. The business started 44 years ago by John Jacobs and his wife, Bernice. Bonnie married into the family and took it over. That's probably the most important to me is that the help I have. Or I could never, never do it. Her beloved staff keeps four ovens going at once. The process starts the day before with the secret instant potato recipe. All of the patties are made into the same size and then they roll the lefsa out by hand. Bonnie says what makes this lefse so special is the recipe and the fact that they roll it out paper thin. Would you like a piece of lefse? Mmm, it is such a treat. Thank, Thank you. you. Up front in the gift shop, they seem to like it just the way it is. Mmm, -hmm. I do know lefse. And this is really good lefse. It is so moist. Very good. Good for the palate. I am 100% Norwegian. Good for the soul. My mother made it and was excellent at making it. So we ate it all winter long. So this is just really special to get something that tastes so much like hers. Kind of like a taste of home. That may be why 90% of their business is shipping. They seal and send packages to New York, Canada, California, and beyond. There's always such a demand because not that many people make it. And no one else in the state makes it. They're all dorks here. Like this. Hi, I'm Joanne with Jacob's Lefse in Osakis. And we, we have, have the best Lefse in Minnesota. That's great. The crew at Jacobs Left says so overloaded right now, they have temporarily shut down internet orders. You can still get the Left stuff if you show up in person, but remember, there is a four pack maximum. Next Thursday at 10, Natalie Nias is looking for the best place to go for a winter run. You can tweet your pick to at Natalie Nias. You can email her at nnias at wcco.com, or you can post your favorite spot on the WCCO Facebook page.